that there is some uh, fundamentals of hopper minecarts that I wasn't doing properly. So let's actually get up top, get some hoppers and some minecarts, and let's do some uh, let's do some experimentation. Um, so I think that I was thinking I had to push the hopper minecart into the block, but potentially I there's uh, some fundamentals of oh, one, one more um, of hopper minecarts that you don't actually need it to be inside the block. I think maybe. That's what the internet seems to indicate. So let's find out. So we want to get uh, hoppers. So everything must be in here. We want a hopper. Or, well, we actually want it's probably six hoppers. And then we're going to need some uh, minecarts. How are we doing today, Puka? We're going to first just do a basic experiment. Uh, I also will need rail. I think that the rail I made last time I just threw. Oh no, I did keep it. Good. Okay, so let's do some tests. Um, so we have this with this, uh, with this on top. And then we're going to have just some regular old blocks on top of that. So what I want to know is... Okay, so they can pull items through a, a block. I think what I was thinking about before was that the soul sand, you had to have, um, or like if you're going to have just a regular hopper, you have to have soul sand or something that's not quite a full block to actually have it work. But this works just fine. So, good. So we can take all this back. Let's go downstairs and do some building. Um, do I want to change what I have in my inventory? No, I think we're good. I'm gonna have to raise those up because I'm uh, now the hop now they won't be actually inside of the obsidian, so I need to give it a little bit more room. But this is very promising. Do, 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 do. You live, you live, you live, bro. All right. Um, so yeah, because they're gonna actually be raised up. So this thing needs to go one higher than where it is. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and break this. So they don't escape. Um, and we're going to move these all up. Uh, we're going to have to also kind of mess around a little bit with the... Um, uh, with the... Uh, the hoppers. Hopper minecarts so that they don't try and escape. Or they don't like run into each other and be stupid. Because they're gonna, there's going to be three of them side by side. Um, I don't really want them running back and forth. So I'll have to experiment with that, I guess. But, uh, all right, we'll do that, that's fine. And then actually let's grab the top ones as well. We're gonna raise those up. Um, and, and these are gonna go as well. I was gonna say, I was just trying to figure out the, the count of how how I'll have enough at the end of all this, but because we can take these guys out too. Ah, all right, I already did for the most part. There we go. And I want that one up there. Can we convince this guy to come with us? Yes, good. All right, so now we want this to be here. And then we're gonna have these five on top of this. So that's temporary stuff for now. Um, then we can, and actually I believe that the other one is the one that you actually go into right now, uh, but we'll set up both. So for now, um, so I have to decide what blocks I want to have around this thing, because I will need to enclose it. Um, so I'm feeling like potentially this stuff would be interesting. Um, so we'll put these around and then... Get rid of these. So what this is, in case you weren't here for that, is when, oh, in fact, we can, to make this a little bit easier on us, we can actually wait to put these on um, until we have them in place. So we have this, these guys go there, and then we're gonna have carts running along here. And we want to have um, 
a crafting bench here. So we'll just put that here for now, so it's convenient for everywhere. And then we're gonna make some carts. My inventory is a little bit messy. Um, I guess we can actually put one in first. So we can put one in. So we, we want it to just kind of stay there. Just stay. And then we want to make another one. And I'm, what, I'm, what I'm worried about is that they're going to run into each other a lot and make a bunch of noise. So I'm going to put that one there. And then when we put the one in the middle, we'll see, we'll see how noisy they get. I mean, people aren't going to be down here too much, but... I still don't really want them to be... Okay, so they stayed where they are. So everything might be okay. And then let's just very, very carefully <laughs> put the top back on. Okay, and now we can't light this one right now. But so in theory, this thing... Aha, yes, good. Noob! Um, no, not really. I've been playing this game for a bit. Um... So yeah, so that grabs those and then moves them into here. Good. Okay, good. Uh, cobblestone. I don't want that. So now let's do the same to the other side, which is where we actually send the stuff through. So we will we'll come back here to make the carts, but for now, let's move this up. Uh, we want to make sure that this is not connected, so we don't lose everything. Okay, good. Oops. Do, 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 do. Oh no, I'm so I'm trapped. Do, do, do. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Somehow we'll get up to the top. <laughs> okay, this is good. Oh, this is my whole, yeah, we can, we'll come back for this stuff. It's kind of a mess. In this version, they are now one block inside. Oh, okay, so they, they fixed that. Um, uh, what about my haircut? Why did your dad haircut? I'm, I'm confused by your text. Uh, yeah, I don't understand. I got a haircut uh, a little bit ago, yeah. In this version, they're one block. Uh, they used to be one bigger than one block. Okay, all right, well, cool. I'm glad that they don't uh, intersect a lot. <laughs> uh, I'm not actually a daddy. Well, it depends on if you... I'm a, I'm a dad to my, my dogs, if that counts. I don't know if that counts or not. But otherwise, I have no children. Okay. Uh, oh, I just realized we're not picking up any of these blocks. Oh, but we didn't, they picked them up here, so we're okay. And then, we want to get rid of these. Good. And then, uh, I'll leave the yeah, those off for now. And then we can work on getting up to the top. Um, <laughs> uh, no, you can't. I, uh... I <laughs> you, uh... You're being very weird. All right, let's put um, these on top, like that. So now we've raised this up. For now, we'll put those in. And then we want to add the blocks onto the side. So same, oop, oh, dig, I dug too much, dug too deep, and mortar. All right, we'll go up here. <laughs> Rude that you can't be my dog. <laughs> um, I'm not, I don't understand your, your text. I'm so confused. All right, we'll go like that. And then we'll add the sea lanterns going around. Um, you guys are, uh, I don't, what? Um, anyway, yeah, you guys are, uh, big annoying. So I'm not, this is your warning to, uh, to not, to not be weird. You can be, you can be regular. You can be a regular person. It's okay. You can do it. All right, put some blocks in here, and then we have a, this one in here. We can get rid of that. Thank you for the follow, uh, Miss uh, Medley. No warnings, yeah, and no caps either, actually. The that this is your your no caps warning. <laughs> All right, let's put uh, this guy over here. So we've enclosed those. Do, 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 do. Okay, so we'll put our rail in here. Boop, 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 boop. And then we'll make our carts. 
And then we'll relight this and we'll test it out. So we have one cart. Um, I guess this other, whatever falls in there. Actually, I guess they're not falling out. They're going on the path on the other side. And then what else? These guys. Okay. So then we'll make some hopper mine carts. Uh, how did you work with uh, such a full inventory? Um, I don't sometimes, actually. Sometimes it's uh, it doesn't work out very well. Um, I even have shulker boxes, but it, it doesn't quite solve my problems. Okay, so we have one here. And then we have one here, and then we're gonna have one here. Good, they're not moving around like crazy. Good. Put some stuff on top. Um, I don't have my flint and steel. Um, so I'll have to get that. Um, I think I have some upstairs. At least I did. Let's go get some. And then we can do our test. Do, 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 do. Hello, Captain Jewel. Welcome, welcome to the stream. We're working on, uh, this is my iron farm, uh, mob farm, oh, this is dangerous. We should finish this path. <laughs> what do we need, lights on the side? Um, uh, this is a big iron farm, uh, mob farm base, that now I'm building a nether portal uh, transportation system. Or at least I'm trying to. We'll see if it works. Uh, okay, and then this side's missing some. Okay, there we go. Good. Much more safe. There we go. And we get rid of these. Uh, where was I? Going up top. Uh, interesting. Okay. Yeah. Good Good job, Scotty Bot. Um, are you on Xbox? I am on the PC. Oh, I took this out. Yeah. Did I take that out or did somebody else take that out? Interesting. I must have done that, I guess. Um, yep, yeah, I'm on uh, PC. Okay, let's get. Um, it's epic. Well, thanks. All right, we want to get flint and steel. Let's try and try and find some flint. I know we have lots of gravel, but I'm trying to see if we can skip the the flint making process. Uh, oh, I have flint and steel. There we go. We can skip the whole thing entirely. Okay, so let's go down to the bottom again. Oh, interesting. So there actually is a ladder here. So what was this over here that I filled in a block for? That's weird. Huh. I wonder what was there. And why Why there is an open... Oh, this is, used to be a hopper. Aha. There used to be a big, huge line of hoppers there that I've since removed. Right. Okay, I remember now. Okay, so you put stuff on there. And now what we want to see is, um, so if we come down into here, this ho this hopper here, which is connected up to this portal, comes out right there. And um, what we want to test is if we put stuff um, into the nether, into the portal, if, it, if they will appear inside this hopper. So we're going to come through here just as a shortcut. All right, so now we're down here in the bottom of the nether below my main portal and then um, the idea is that there, there'd be a whole line of hoppers coming over to here from somewhere else and then when it gets into the last one it goes into a dropper the dropper sees that there's stuff in there and then shoots it into the portal so as a test we're going to throw seven rail into the portal Boop, ba -doop. hello um, a wild meme level 300 so we're gonna throw uh, seven rail into the portal so it looks like it actually goes through but then it absorbs it if we look over here then it's not behind it welcome amy nine uh okay now i have to remember how to get up that's right here i guess okay so we're gonna put this here we can get up here yes i'm on pc and i think this path should let me get all the way up um it, this isn't the most direct path but i don't want to go through that portal because then i might end grabbing the items into my inventory so we're gonna walk all the way around this kind of windy, windy, dangerous path I made in the nether. Uh, this is a, uh, it's only for my patrons actually. Um, oh, all right, and then I did that. Okay, let me, uh, do I have, oh, I can make ladders, okay. Um, so if you're a patron of mine, you're able to get on here. Uh, information on the TeamBS patron server. 
is there. Uh, but it's for my, my patrons and I, we would play on here. Do -do -do -do. So, uh, so pro I guess probably not, unless you want to become a patron. It would be the... Wait, wait, let's make a bunch of ladders. I should have grabbed ladders. I didn't think about it. Do -do 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 -do. All right. Let's, um, so we want to be careful of... I don't really want <laughs> the nether to be right there. So let's do that. Uh, then we'll build a ladder going up. Just a service service ladder. So we get up to the top. And then here, what's up here? Okay. Let's go... Uh, what blocks do we want to use? Let's just use regular, regular stuff. Let's build a little uh, service elevator or whatever. Not really an elevator, a service uh, ladder. Okay, and then we'll pop right there. It's not quite done, but we can add more as we go up. Having some hitbox issues. Oh, I keep on putting it back there. <laughs> okay, there we go. And... Did it. Like that. We'll get there. So, the uh, what's happening right now with those seven... Uh, seven things that we need to put down there. So they are, they've gone through the portal, but they're just sitting down um, on the, um, uh, sitting down on that portal and probably haven't gone through the hoppers, I'm assuming. But once we load into the zone, that's when I think they start getting absorbed into the hoppers, I think. So we, we've come out of the top of the base. And now what we wanna see is uh, in the bottom of the base, at the other portal over here. If uh, those items are uh, inside this hopper over here. That's the wrong hopper. This hopper. Yes. Okay, sort of. Interesting. So there's one item here. So it actually kept its momentum. Interesting. So there's one there. That we can't pick up because we have too many sticks. Where is the other one? Yeah, momentum is conserved. Very interesting. Uh, where? Oh, where is the other one? Huh. Because I threw seven in, we ended up with six in the end. So, is there one on the ground somewhere in here? Um, flame serum, yeah, right. Huh. It's not down there, is it? Oh, it is. Okay, so they, all right, so they did shoot through. Okay, so we can deal with that. So if I'm going to, um, I could put, I mean, I could just cover up the portal, really. I don't need to have it accessible. Two questions for you, Basket. I'm ready. Um, have you... Um, have you show an arrow through the portal? Have I shot an arrow through the portal? I have not. And have you played the game Portal? I have, yeah, yeah. No, I, I understand the, the conservation of... Yeah, I understand that it'll, it'll keep its... I was thinking it wouldn't. I was thinking it would just, like, load in and drop. Um, but no, I, I understand. So now what I want to do is decide how I want to cover up the side. Um, I could do glass. Or I could just do lights. 
I think seeing it probably would be more interesting. Um, so let's see what, oh, do, we do have, uh, I think we do have, uh, materials we need. No, that's cactus. Blue glass? Do we want blue glass? Let's see. Let's give it a try. Do, 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 do. All right, and then let's go to the other side. Um. Oh yeah, you killed somebody by shooting arrows. That's cool. I had, I didn't recall that. All right, let's go like this. Do, do. Oh yeah, I remember the inversion server. Good times. Nope, nope, try again. There we go. Oh no, I didn't. I missed it up still. There we go. Okay. Um, so I'll decide how that looks. <laughs> I guess we want to have it supported in the bottom. Hello, little spooky. Welcome. Do, 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 do. Actually, I'm kind of thinking now I want to have it, uh, have the lights going around it. Because then I don't have to worry about some of the lighting. Let's try that. Do, do, do. And then we don't have to put these on top. Do, 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 do. And then I'm not, I haven't decided, I guess I'll have probably them just be too wide in the bottom. Maybe. We'll see. Okay. And let's get rid of some of this stuff. Okay. So we have room and armature right now. We can put our pistons away. And we can switch to our axe that I don't have. I don't have an axe. I don't own an axe on the server anymore. A little spooky. Um, remove the S. I'm so confused. <laughs> Less, not as confused as uh, earlier. <laughs> okay, yeah, so do I want... What do I want the bottom blocks to be? I feel like that, and then... I probably want to change the bottom. Ah, stop it. Go away. Hmm. Or I make... Maybe I'll make that be the, the blue glass. Let's see how that looks. Yeah, I think I like that better. A little boogie. <laughs> do, 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 do. And so we'll, oh, it's already how the side is. Okay. So then, I think for to match the styling, we can do uh, this, and then we simply just need to connect it together. So let's get a hopper, connect, perfect. So now that portal is operational. Um, only one of them needs to really be in place. I I believe it's this one. Um, but we can get the other one set up to be a mirrored image, and these guys will stop throwing stuff at me. I think I can actually add more rings onto this thing to make it <laughs> a little bit safer when the guys don't die. That might be better. That would be a good idea. Okay, so we have uh, those things are inside of there. So we can get rid of this. Uh, we can follow the same design. And then they go across like that on the top. Uh, these go across over here. Pop down here. We can put our hopper back in. Um, put this on top. Get rid of all this stuff. Uh, I'll leave that, I think. Oh, 
Oh, actually, I want to keep that. Um, here I thought you could do the hopper minecart thing for the mob drops too. Um, yeah, it's possible. Although the problem with the witches is they have a uh, fire resistance, so I don't think that they would. Um, I think they would resist. They would resist being on fire. Yeah, fiddlesticks. Fiddlesticks, indeed. Boop, boop. Uh, the other, yeah, was, I mean, that would fix the um, the issue with them having feather falling, but it would not really fix the issue with um, the witches. Okay. So, the next thing is, is why do I have so many of these over here? And, oh, I do have them over there, too. Oh, okay. Why do I have... Is that... Oh, because the mechanics are... There's more... More stuff in there. Okay, well, let's, let's duplicate it on this side. So that comes all the way out to the glass. Um, and then we have slabs on top of that that are raised up. So let's do that. Do, 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 do. Is it mirrored on both sides then? I guess that's not filled in on the other one. So these are filled in on that side, but not in this. I guess we'll fill them both in over here. Okay, there we go. And then this one for now has a temporary walking thing. Eventually that'll be gone. Um, and so then this is the portals where the items will come in, in theory. Um, so I think that'll work. So then what we can do is we want to go up to the top. Uh, I guess for now we will put in um, a temporary path to get over there. Oop, okay, and then going up. And then we want to get a bunch of hoppers. And then I'm going to work on bringing this hopper chain all the way over to uh, the nether hub area. So we can we can transport items from there, in theory. We can test it out um, all the way over. So we want to put a bunch of stuff away. Uh, prismarine blocks, sea lanterns. And then we can put our redstone away. We want to get hoppers out and a bunch of chests. Thank you for the follow, Human Echoes. Cool name. Uh, let's put our yeah, put the, these away, um, and then we might make a bunch more hoppers. Love that follow gift. Yeah, that's uh, from uh, Happy Tuesday. Yeah, um, that's from um, uh, Kegley Kegley Antics on uh, on here. She uh, she made that. Um, Let me get the, uh... nope, I did it wrong. Interesting. All right, well, I'll have to look it up later. But anyway, Kegley Antics. Now nah, she's out there. I was going to try and do a shout out, but I don't remember how to spell her mixer thing. She also streams in here. All right, let's do, um, so we want to get rid of this. And we want to get a bunch of chests. Aha, trap chests, regular chests. So we can do another 60. That is probably, probably plenty. Um, we'll also want to make sure that we can we can build a mechanism down there. So we're going to need, what, comparators? We have that. We'll need droppers. Uh, we have repeaters. Should be good. Oh, and actually, we can keep some of these being chests. Um, so let's actually grab some of these chests as well. Because we can make, um, as we're doing a vertical... Um, or which one would be less leggy? I guess uh, droppers would be less leggy. So if we had a lot of droppers uh, as part of a vertical chain of hoppers, then that would be less leggy and conserve on iron, which I guess we have lots of, but we can still do it. Um, 
Or I could also not worry about it. Because I do have lots of iron. I'm an iron farm after all. So maybe I'll just make a bunch of hoppers. So we will make um, the thing. We'll go like that first. And then like that. Doot. Something I want. Could use the thing on the left. That's probably <laughs> would be more efficient. There we go. A little better. The best of the animation you use for the follow is that a GIF or a type of video? It is a GIF. Or if you're weird, GIF. Not, uh, not not weird. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna judge you if you say GIF. That's fine. <laughs> you can say GIF if you want. Is that trap? That's trap. Just. You should be able to make uh, trap chest hoppers that do something else different. Cool. Uh, GIF is the peanut butter. GIF is uh, a uh, dang nabbit. <laughs> do you get... Oh, I see. It's GIF. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. I threw an extra word in there, so I confused myself. Yeah, I agree. I agree that... I understand the debate people have, but it doesn't mean I agree with them. Okay, so now we have a bunch of hoppers and some other stuff. Um, we uh, do we have fire resistance gear? Um, no, so we have to keep in mind that we're not we, we could we could be hurt from lava. All right, so now let's go to the Nether. We'll build the mechanism downstairs. Um, I'll I'll want to double check the coordinates for. Um, for spawn and also lets me, let me get this up and running so I can see it there we go so now we're up here um, and we want to get the coordinates for where we actually want to build this thing so what I'm thinking is is I mean I might connect it up in different spots but at the very least make it so that I can drop items in uh, from the nether hub over here and I think actually past your bedtime all right well take care of the pook have a good night. So like here, uh, don't be a slow poke. Oh, okay, so then this is, these are speed potions. So potentially, like right here, um, I could have a thing where you could, if you drop stuff into this thing, it would shoot it down onto, um, <laughs> um, onto um, hoppers down below that then would take it all the way over. So I wouldn't actually have to have a whole chain of hoppers going down from here. Um, it would just drop down and then be absorbed. So the path, so this is the coordinates I'm trying to get to. Where's my pen? There we go. Um, so negative 18 um, and then 73, irrelevant, and uh, negative 62. So I'll try and get over to that um, from there. One thing I might do, I don't have a lot of ladders. So I think I'll dig back to this and then maybe dig up because there's possible that there's going to be a lava lake in between the two. <laughs> uh, like from all the way down at the bottom coming up because I, for the other path I made, I had to go through uh, or underneath the lava lake. So we'll see where that lines up. But the idea is then you can, you can bring items into the big storage system by dropping them into there and then other or that could branch off to somewhere else possibly, things like that. So head down into there and then go through our winding <laughs> staircase here. Okay, so we are back here. And so actually while we're here, let's very carefully, let's make a, a spot for the lava to flow. So fall into if it happens to fall. Looks like we're okay. Um, then what I want to do is put in, or I, I guess I need to get redstone stuff. So let's get our red, redstone supplies. Keep in mind anything that goes into the portal is going to be absorbed. So we have to be careful with that. Um, let's see. So if I wanted to, I do have this so I can relight it. Is there an easy way? Oh, I guess I can break, break the frame. 
There we go. Because what I want to do is I want to put this here, but I can't place it through the portal. So we do that. Um, now we can just throw those in there. Um, have hoppers running into it. Oh, I guess I should also put stuff on top of these hoppers so that they cause less lag. I'll come back to that. Um, then, I think actually oh, I do have furnaces in here. Droppers are a little bit better, but furnaces will work. So we'll grab some of those. And then we want to have a comparator. Uh, running over the side. So we'll put these extra blocks in just to... Well... Actually, I'll pull, I'll pull off on this side so that we can enclose the entire portal. So put these guys in, comparator, and then um, if there is a signal, I want to try to think about how I want to set this up. <laughs> try and walk and talk, chew bubble gum. Um, so I'll want a repeater, some redstone. I'm done with the comparators. So I want to, when this thing has items inside of it, which it does. So when it doesn't have items, I want it to stop. So we're gonna, when there isn't items, I wanna invert, and this is gonna kill the signal. Um, and I guess we want to, I'm gonna build a little platform of regular blocks here so that we don't, so we have a better idea of where the redstone is. All right, so that's gonna kill the clock when that is on. So when that's off, then this thing will keep on going, I think. Uh, we do want to add this in. That might actually, that might do it. Let me, let me try. <laughs> no, right, there's no signal coming to this thing. Right, okay, that's fair. Um, so then we'll put some blocks on top of this and go like that. Uh, we'll need to let's make this a little bit bigger. We'll get there. All right. Um, okay. Let me think. So. When there are no blocks in there, this thing is going to go on a clock. So we, we want the opposite of this. <laughs> um, so let's actually take this out. So what we want is... Oh, actually, here. There's the only thing I can do. Is I have a little bit more space if I take these and move over here and bring that into the side. Because that's still going to be blocks to block this thing off. And then we have... We can come over and power this thing from the side instead. So now... We're going to have a block here with the clock on top of it. So this clock will just run. Um, like that. We'll have that on top. There we go. Okay, there we go. So now this clock isn't going to run when there's no items. If there are items... It doesn't run. This thing, interesting. Oh, I see, because it's actually bleeding into this. Huh. Um, okay. <laughs> okay, we're gonna move this over. We're, we're gonna get there. Okay, so that is, um, all right, great. So now, <laughs> I think this is actually gonna work. Ready? So let me explain. Um, uh, so this, when this has items inside of it, or when it, when it has no items, this thing turns on, which stops this clock from running. Um, when, there might be a better way of doing this. And so when this has items, ladders, they get shot out into the hopper. Or into the into the uh, into this thing. Good. So that's the way back up. 
Um, there we go. So if we need to get back up, we can go that direction. Um, otherwise, we can just close this off. And then we'll light this up. And then close the rest of it up. And we're out of slabs. So it's all closed up, and so any items that go in there... Oh, actually, I'm sorry, we're going to have a furnace on top of this. There we go. So now this path can just keep on going... Probably, I think this... Well, actually, I don't really know which way is... So we want the first number to be lower. So we actually want to go back this way. And then 60... So we want to go kind of in that direction. So we're going to actually loop this around. I thought that this was the side. Oh, well. So we're going to loop this around um, uh, and go over that direction. So we're going to go this way. And we'll come back and we'll add in the um, some of the other stuff later, like the, the uh, um, whatchamacallit, the furnaces and stuff later. But we can take this over there manually for now. So we'll take, uh, we'll make it be a three high path, I guess, so that we can, or I guess it'll be a four high path eventually, but for now, I guess we'll do two, two high. And then we're getting ready to get rid of the lava, if lava starts pouring on our head. Because uh, that's very possible. And then let's double check our direction. So that's going down, which is good, because this needs to get down to 18, the first number. So we're just going to go straight over to 18, negative 18 rather. And then we're gonna go um, over to one of the directions, I think to our left, to get the other number in the right spot. I'm being a little bit cautious because I don't wanna lose everything. I don't have a fire resistance potion. Okay, I want one more. Now we are at 18. And then... So that goes up. Yeah, so we want to go that direction to 62. Okay, so good. This one, there's some, there is some lava, but it didn't get us. Good job, us. 62. Okay, so that is right here. So then, we need to make it be a little bit taller. <laughs> so again, we're watching for lava. Quartz, I like quartz. Okay, turning. Being careful. Watching for lava. Concentrating. Oh no. Okay, we have an opening. Interesting. Let's just close that up. Doesn't even exist. Okay, good. Um, so now, we can run this hopper line all the way over. Okay, we're gonna hold down and shift while we do it. <laughs> How's our time? Okay, we're low on time. We'll be uh, ending soon, but I'll see if I can how much I, of this I can get done in, in place. We'll probably build that other tunnel coming down instead of building up to it, because uh, there might be lava, so it'd be a little safer if we if we dug down to it.
Hopefully we'll have enough. I think we should. I think we had like three stacks. I can, like, wouldn't have to hold down and shift <laughs> to, to place it. I wish there was a way I could tell it, like, like, just the not, not open it up. Like, caps lock, you know? If you hold on a caps lock, or if you hit caps lock, that it wouldn't, uh, oh yeah, okay, hold on. I didn't safely, uh, make this thing be the same height. Okay, so that should line up, I think, with where we have to go. Uh, there are actually some quartz here, so let's just deal with some of this. And this will actually go into our sorting system. So that's kind of handy. So we can just get rid of that, and that, and that. And we'll fill in the uh, little gaps here. Uh, building your main base in the nether. Ah, so this is, um, it's a item transportation system. Um, so this is from the nether hub, you could throw items into a thing and they drop down and then they would go over to another portal, appear into the big iron base, uh, iron, uh, iron golem farm, and then, uh, and then get sorted into the uh, system. Is the idea. So uh, I'm gonna use furnaces. I know that the droppers are less leggy, but I already have furnaces. Okay. Okay. Welcome, James. By the way. So build some of these going all the way over till we run out, and then we'll stop placing them because we're gonna be out after that point. Um, yeah, I, from what I understand, uh, furnaces help quite a bit, but then droppers are a little bit better. Um, but I don't, uh, I don't have droppers on me. I don't, I don't have that many droppers, because this is a <laughs> very long path. I haven't done the science myself. Uh, I just, so people tell me, is the best, best way to do it. All right, good. Um, so then what we want to do is I'll actually, I'll just come back and add in those later. Um, so we're actually gonna walk all the way up to the top um, and then we're gonna build, dig down that other path. But I think we'll have to actually do that next time. I have to, uh, this is sort of a weird weird timing for, for a stream um, because I had to wait for the furnace guy to show up. Um, but, so I'm gonna head up to the top and uh, thank you everybody for stopping by. That was not a, uh, that was not a, um, uh, a troll. Thank you everybody that was not a troll for stopping by. <laughs> Appreciate it.